Oh yes, yeah. I have. Um, I have family that lives in the South. I have a cousin in Alabama, and huh. oh, I think we try to talk about things that are um, uh, not politics, and not religion. And you know, we have a very diverse family in terms of religion. You know, there most of them are religious, but there are Baptists and Methodists and Catholics and. There have been Jews, and my, my mother's family came, French Catholic married a French Jew, and Mama Arch went home and announced to the two families that they were getting married, they'd gotten married, and they were disowned by both families, so they moved to San Francisco. I mean, where would you go? So, you know, the, the reality is that I think we try to stay away from politics and religion. If it comes up, we agree to disagree, usually. We may agree on certain things, you know. They're, they tend to be environmentalists, they tend to care about the environment, they, uh, tend to believe in education and my grandmother told her children the most important thing you could have in this world is to have an education and even though I'm the first in my direct line to go to college some of my dad's brothers and sisters actually did get to go partly because he sent money home when his uncle my uncle Irv, Ishmael Irving Easton was uh, at uh, Eastern Kentucky University when the house burned down and my grandfather went bankrupt so my dad joins the Navy and sends money home and that's how Irvin became an engineer the good news was he became the pilot of the Goodyear blimp, so I got to fly on the blimp a couple of times before I was in an airplane. So, but you know, my parents were really good about taking us traveling. They, they, we went on a lot of day trips and weekend trips, and then we went and drove across country th several times. And uh, so, and my dad would make th a point to stop at all what he called the hysterical landmarks, the historical landmarks, and so. He was an amazing man. He, would, he was strict about our allowance. We didn't get our allowance, we didn't do our chores. So 35 cents a week became 50 cents, became a dollar. But we got a dollar for every poem we memorized. So I know a lot of poetry and it really helped my memory actually. It was brilliant. So.